Waxes are perfect for short cuts or to add finishing touches to longer ones. They're excellent for classic men's grooming and vary in hold and finish. Use styling wax for light hold and high shine. Sumo wax for strong hold and high shine. And Sumatech for strong, flexible hold with a matte finish. Styling wax is a water soluble combination of waxes and silicone that gives the kind of shiny finish usually achieved with oils, making it far less greasy than its predecessors. Waxes used to take days to wash out, driving models crazy. A little styling wax gives separation to any cut and a lot gives sleek grooming with soft hold. Hair stays malleable, allowing styles to change direction. Here we're going to show you a great example of how to get separation using the styling wax. First we choose the right amount, rubbing it well into your hands to soften the product which will make it easier to apply. With Adriana's hair we dried it with a diffuser and it was a little bit fluffy. So putting the styling wax first through the middle ends and starting in the back where it's most dense, working it through and through to the ends. As we work our way round the head we get to the front and by that time we've just a little amount on the hands. pulling it through and making sure we've got enough product on the hair to show that separation and the definition that Styling Wax will give you. With Matt I gave him a classic English schoolboy haircut. Now for versatility with haircuts we have to use our products. Here I'm using the wax, rubbing it into my hand again, get it nice and soft and then starting through the back. The application is very important of how you put it through the hair. Starting through the back, work my way through the front, I'm pushing it through my fingers to make sure that I feel the product in the hair. Now I'm going to take my comb and create a nice low parting and push it to the side. Here's where we see the hold and a fantastic shine just finishing off this very versatile haircut with the styling wax. The styling wax allows me to take a haircut which is worn day to day, very natural, but here I want to increase the contrast and the shine which gives me more of a rocker look. Now we're going to show you how the styling wax will create soft hold, separation and shine. With Raquel I'd given her a classic little box bob with bangs and then we gave it a curling iron set. Now to break that up I used the wax, rubbing it thoroughly into my hands to soften it and then starting in the back again. Working it through my hands all the way roots to ends because I really want to get that separation and break up this set. using it through both sides. Now I'm going to take a brush and just get rid of the bangs. And that just shows me the versatility, the hold of the product, and will show you the shine through the end. Laurent Philippon, Bumble and Bumble editorial stylist and a Parisian with endless curiosity, became enthralled with the part hairdressing played in ancient Japanese rituals, where wax is melted in iron cauldrons, applied and then cooled to set glossy black helmets of hair. His interpretation, sumo wax, gives strength of character to modern cuts, flexible hold, textural effects and definition of detail. It disciplines heavyweights, yet won't overwhelm finer types. Products work best on great haircuts. With Matt, I gave him a slight undercut and a longer top. I want you to take this conservative look and turn it into something quite strong. Just using my brush and the dryer just to push it into shape allows me to then take the wax and finish the job. I use my blow dryer to melt the product in the jar. This just makes it easier for application and you can see it as it hardens into the hair. coming all the way through more of a kind of teddy boy look which was an English character in the 50s and uh, you can see 
I get that shine. Most importantly, I get hold and a little bit of flexibility. That's why I use the Sumo Wax. With Katie, we'd scrunched her hair and I wanted to get a lot more separation in there. It was quite flat, quite dull, and I chose the Sumo Wax to do that job. I heat it up in a jar, again for application, push it through the hair, and you can see as I'm pushing it through the hair what it's doing. The hair's starting to react. It's getting a lot more separation. The contrast is improving. The hair just comes alive. My haircut looks fantastic. She's absolutely gorgeous. Now we're going to take Chandra and show you how the Sumo Wax can create strong hold and shine. As Nikki's pushing it through the hair, you can see immediately that she's getting that hold through the side and she'll just work into the top and then through into the other side. Now we're mainly working it through the front because that's where it's most powerful. Now you can see that texture just really come alive. The hold is fantastic and you can see the super shine. Our stylists wanted to create stretch in hair, pliability and lasting memory. And Sumatec is a hybrid solution. It's not a wax, not a paste, but a mid-weight moulding compound. It's an all-time favourite and natural for short hair, even if it's fine. The best way to show off your hair cutting is with products. Here I'm going to show you the power of one product, Sumotec. With Matt, I gave him the undercut, and then I'm going to use the Sumotec just to show him a quick, sort of easy way to do his hair, just pushing it back, very natural, flexible, and when I say flexible, I've got that nice control, but it's not stiff. For the second look, because the product is water soluble, I'm using some tonic to break it down. I'll reapply some more Sumo Tech and go with a middle parting, something quite natural. You can let this just dry in, but it's something a guy can use in her hair day to day. For a more extreme look, I'm just sort of squeezing the product further into his hair, really manipulating it, and going for something more like a rockabilly, but obviously with a curl. And as you can see, it's a great matte finish. No pun intended. And remember, this is one product. No tools, just my hands and a great haircut. With Chandra here, I want to show you how to get that lightweight, flexible hold. Now, what does that mean? It means you can put the product into the hair a little bit at a time, work it through, and add more as you need it. Here, we're going for something quite natural. Just let the haircut's texture come out. For a bit more structure with the Sumo Tech, we applied a little bit more, just pushing it back at the sides, through the top, and just looking for something a bit more groomed and with that structure and a great matte finish. With Rachel, here's a great example how to use a Sumo Tech and a hot tool. Applying the Sumo Tech through the damp hair, again, pushing it in really get the product into the hair. If it's only in one area, it just won't work. So make sure I've got enough product all the way through. Now I'll take the small flat iron and just start through the sides, and just pushing the product into the hair. And we know with hot tools, just watch the steam, not being too close to your head or you will burn the scalp. Working all the way through, really pushing the product in to the hair. And as you can see, a great matte finish, separation, almost like a young Debbie Harry look. Very cool. <laughs> 